Hey, what's up? It's Aaron Y from eSickJuiceReview.com here with uh, Zero. Basically, it's a variable wattage, uh, variable voltage device that's like a Duke sort of. Um, is was discontinued because the Z went back in stock. I'll talk about it and link to it. I'm vaping on a uh, Trident V2 clone. It's a cool little airflow thing right here. I like it a little bit better than the Trident V1. And um, it's a fast tech uh, glass drip tip. It's like $2 or even $100. It's pretty good. Um, it works good on some Addies, but it only has one O ring. So on some Addies, it's not enough support. But it's really good flavor from the glass. And I'm here talking to you about Ben Johnson's. Um, and Johnson's really cool. He makes, um, you probably, have, you haven't tried Oreo, you should try it. It's an old container. Here's a new container. And, yeah, it's good stuff. And, but his other line is pretty good, but it's not really for me. But, um, I'm talking about uh, his juice right now. So, hopefully we'll go through it. So right now, um, we are, I'm vaping Nebula, which is a grape lychee. And I like lychee juices a lot, but, um, this lychee juice, okay, let's turn it down, put some more juice in that, but, uh, basically, um, this lychee is, the grape is a little too candied. Here, nebula, pow. So it's like, uh, it's, I like um, wine flavor, but most grapes I've tried are like grape juice, like kid fiber, just a little bit too much. So here's the juice, so it's in 12. So basically what I'm gonna do is take it, um, through 8, like 15, the 30, and then 50. So, yeah. As you can see, it's pretty good uh, vapor for um, 8 watts. The grape is really there. This tastes like grape juice. So the wine, it's uh, way too sweet. And there's a hint of lychee. So let's try it on 15. So, um, hmm. Put a little more juice in. It's a little not as sweet. The flavors are a little bit more fused. Um, the grape kind of gets out of there, but I uh -uh. see the problem with going through most watts is that most juice behave the same. But there's a couple exceptions, and everyone wants to know what it tastes like at different wattage. So if you're after a KD grape. It's good. You can see the vapor's great, so let's turn it up to 30. Well, I need to put a bigger piece of cut next time. <laughs> it's funny, the more cotton you put in, the less the vapor. But this one. Yeah, a uh, little less sweet, a little bit more lychee, more fusion. So just turn it all the way up to 30, 50. No, it was 30 before, now it's 50. Look, Let's see. Whoa. This. So basically, yeah, it 
if you're after really good um, grape juice and you just want like the sweet grape juice, it's a good grape. And it's a nice hint of lychee. Yeah, lychee is more present now before, but it's still too sweet. And vape is good. So, um, yeah, that's my review of Nebula by Ben Johnson's. So basically what I'm going to do is, uh, it's a little hot. Let's turn this down. It's cool. You can turn the waters down. And I'm going to rinse out the cap. See, there's cotton in there. It's so much cotton. It wasn't enough. But, um, so what I do is, so the cap, boom, boom. Cool. And, um, where's my cut? Put it here. Get you better. So, yeah. Try to burn it. Cool. So, try it. A little bit more. So next, just cause you know Ben Johnson's a nice guy. So I'm an EEC, and um, gave me these great juices to try and review. And I've talked about Oreo before, and they basically they did as they um the Oreo company gave me a cease and desist letter, and so that wasn't very nice, and so they had to change their name to Cream. So here, the same air holes. So I'm going to drip some Oreo. Oh, it's called cream. They even have a three years and seven D. So it's all the way down. Yeah. Crispy, creamy Oreo flavor. It's great at the water, it is. it's a little bit sweet. Add some more juice and then let's try it at 15. So that's eight. A little sweet. The fusion of flavors isn't quite there. Um, but. It is interesting. Yeah. So at 15, it's a little bit more toasty, still sweet. And um, let's try it at thir uh, 3, but basically more fusion and not as sweet. Well, a 3D, the toasty flavor Oreo really comes out. And it's the juice that made Ben Johnson famous. Um, I really, I recommend it. If you like Oreo cookies at all. And it's actually like, um, it's pretty good. So let's try it at 50. Whoa. Drip it in at 50. I don't think this juice is meant for that high of a water edge. It's not as sweet in the crazy fusion, but it's a little bit of burnt. So maybe that means I need more juice. The cotton doesn't look burnt. Yeah, the flavor is a little bit burnt. It's not great at 50, but you know, at uh, at 30, it's, it's great. So if, if you're, you vape around 30 watts, you really like it. At 50, this juice is going to be made for that. So I'm going to take this top off. Ah. So the um, Trident V2 clone, uh, I recommend it. It's 
way better than the Trident V1 because you won't have to adjust the O-rings, change the airflow. It's um, it's pretty nice. Like I like um the heads. I think it's the easiest to build because if you look at it here, I hold this up to the camera after it rinses out. I dry burn, but you see the screw heads. You can just move it with your finger. It's pretty cool. You don't need to use a screwdriver. You can. But um, next one is Apology, which is apricot. Uh, I haven't had the best um, luck with apricots. Um, there are two other juices which I'm not going to try today but they, because they're apricot tea and there's some uh, other tea. And um, they weren't like in your face flavors. But um, yeah, I like more in your face. The nebula is a lot of flavor. And the cream, it's a lot of flavor, and all these flavors are good, but there are two teas that they make, and Ben Johnson makes, um, isn't enough flavor for me. But, um, okay, let me just try a little bit more cotton, and let's go for his next flavor. Hmm. This is Apology. It's 12 milligrams. I'm not sure on the, the VGPG. I may send an email and figure it out. Um, basically, here the cap unscrews so you can adjust it. And then I'm going to leave both air holes open. And then twist this down. Yeah, I like both air holes open even on a single coil. A lot of um, a lot of airflow, a lot of vapor, and oh, like some people like only one air hole for single coils. I like dual. Okay, turn it back down. This was eight, and um. I don't know, it's, it tastes like candy peaches to me, like peach rings, but somehow it's apricot. I guess it's a little sweeter than peaches, but I don't know. Let's try it at uh, 15. Get your face flavor, it's nice. 15 is a little less sweet. More a fusion of the different aspects. Let's try it at 30. Hmm. That's good. Oh, fix the background a little bit here. Uh, that's a standard um, uh, assortment pack that I want. It's pretty cool. Yeah, sorry. I've been really far behind in reviews. So I've just been really sick. Um, but hopefully I'll be getting to them. Yeah, 30, still a little sweet, more fusion, and let's try it at 50. Whoa. Yeah, this one tastes a little bit burnt at 50. Let me try a little bit more juice. Yeah, okay. 50 is not burnt. It's just lacking juice. It actually holds up better than the cream or Oreo. Yeah, I think it's the best of 50. Still candied peach apricot. It's a little bit sweeter. Yeah, but it's not for me. But hey, if you like a really good peach, then you might like this. So. Take this out, 
can't see it's a little bigger it's kind of not burnt it's good I burn and then rinse this out so basically what I'm doing is I'm rinsing out the top cap and the drip tip a little like bowl and some water over here good water and basically what it does is like um, some juices stick in the top cap of the atomizer in the base but I burn off everything in the base and so the top cap um, is a new piece of cotton you're able to get the authentic flavor so next one is morning dew which is blueberry and lemon I think yeah but let's try it out So this drip tip is glass, great flavor, it's pretty good. I, I recommend picking one up for the price. I remember paying like um, $30 back in the day for a glass drip tip. Oh. Cool. I don't know today, I woke up early. Wow. So that is at 50. So it's a good juice. Um, yeah, it's really good. It's a, like a toasty cereal type of thing. Blueberries, a little candy, lemon, good vapor, good flavor. It's not in your face like the other flavors, but it's better than teas. It's like in between. It's nice. Try it at 15. It's nice. Uh, this is, I mean, it's up there with the cream, if not even better. So it's, it's a good juice. So, yeah, 15 is great, good flavor. Let's just try it at 30. Wow, good vapor, good flavor. Still a little on the sweet side, but I like the cereal taste and the lemon's nice zest. Too bad this the candy blueberries, but um, it's pretty good. So that was at 50. Let me add another drop because this is not. Ooh, hey. Still tastes a little burnt. Let's go back to 30. Yeah, it's better at 30. At 50, the flavors taste a little bit um, burnt, but at 30, it's great flavor. You got sweet blueberry, amazing lemon, and cereal. I highly recommend this juice, even though the blueberry is a little sweet, but it's great lemon and cereal flavor. So the next one is jammin, which is uh, like a mango, like, think of like jammin, like a uh, Bob Marley song. Let's wash this off.
So, Jesus have left jam and Snicker Fritz. Uh, actually, what? I don't remember the flavor of Snicker Fritz, but. Guess I'll. Let's see. Yeah, my favorite lemon is sweet summer lemonade, and um, the Morning Dew by Ben Johnson's is um, very similar, like lemon flavor. I like the cereal too. But wow! So let's turn this down. And so we're doing this pineapple coconut type of thing. Ah, usually pineapple juices aren't the best for me, but. Okay, air hold. Oh, only one air hold. That's why I still have some left to say. Um, this juice doesn't perform as well, but that's because the air holds. Look like that. Ah. And just the air holes. Close it. Yeah. Um, this juice, uh, pineapple, some other stuff, it's a little bit sweet, the uh, performance you can see. There's not much vapor. Um, let's try it out, it's a little bit too sweet, and the uh, pineapple doesn't really do it for me. I like it, there isn't that much coconut. So 15, a little better flavor, a little bit less sweet, more fusion. Try it at 30. A little more toasted, a little more fusion, a little less sweet, it's good. Try it at 50. Tastes um, kind of burnt, maybe it's not meant for 50. Yeah. Not meant for 50. Uh, go to the next juice, Snickle Fritz. So, so far, I really liked Morning Dew and Oreo and Cream. Oh, yikes, I burnt that a little bit. Actually, you know what? Uh, Oh, like coconut, no, like coconut, pineapple, yeah, pineapple. Oh. So, let's make a friend. Hmm, this smells interesting. And actually, it's on my other computer. What is flavor? Ah, can't read it. I can tell what flavor it is. So I'm doing a massive review because I'm trading these uh, these juices in my uh, review with the Reamizer. Today it's yeah, it's pretty cool. There it is, the Rio. Close the door. But um, I'm. I think the uh, reviews on the aqua and maybe more for like thirty minutes each flavor is a better way to do reviews than just massively going through them. But um, oh, this one is a ki uh, kiwi, candy kiwi. Ah, okay, it's not for me. It's too candy. The uh, 15. It performs decently, but 
is still a bit too sweet. So, um, dirty. Yeah. Yes, kiwi and something else. Um, it's not for me, but if you like kiwi. But out of these juices, I really like the cream and, um, I like the morning juice the best. So, um, this is Aaron Wyatt, you seek juice review, and I'll talk to you later. Hope you enjoyed what I had to say about Ben Johnson.